Hi boys and girls. This week we are talking about zoo animals and we are going to go on a safari. And when you're on a safari, you need binoculars. So I have some binoculars that I found around my house here. Binoculars help you to see things that are far away up close. They, they bring it closer to you by looking through the binoculars. So we are going to make our own binoculars. Now, when we make our own binoculars, they're not gonna be able to bring the object or the animal closer to us. It's not gonna look closer to us, but it is going to help us to focus on the animal. So what you're going to need is yarn or twine or some sort of string to make the strap. strap that goes around your neck for the binoculars. I'm going to use yarn. You also can have markers to make it really colorful, but I think I'm going to use color colorful yarn and I'm going to show you how to do that here in a second. You also need either a hole punch if you don't have a hole punch, um, which my hole punch isn't very good, you can also have mom or dad make a little hole for you on each side of your binoculars. I am using two toilet paper rolls, or you can use a paper towel roll and cut that paper towel in half. But I'm using two toilet paper rolls because that's what I had. And then you're gonna put those two rolls together and you can use tape to tape them together or you can use a stapler. I happen to have a stapler here at home and that's what I'm going to use. Um, but either way, it will work. Now that your binoculars are finished, mine are finished, I'm so happy with them, we're gonna go on a safari. This week on our website, you get to go to the zoo and to Boonshop Museum to see different animals. So I challenge you to take your binoculars and get on our website and learn about all kinds of different animals. Have fun.